Oh, if that isn't the daintiest little beverage ever. Let's put this in my intestinal system. <laughs> so it looks like pee a little bit, but some of the best drinks in life look like pee. <laughs> It's like someone was thinking about a lemon and then farting. Gonna have to give Match Match a 4 out of 10. But let's go try something crazier. Oh, I literally didn't know she was laying. <laughs> I'm so mean. I'm so mean, baby. Imagine I just land on her and kill my dog and that's how the video starts. Just land on her and kill my dog and that's how the video starts. Eat your vegetables! <laughs> How dare you take an animal who never did a single thing wrong to you and chop them up into pieces? Leave animals the f alone. Why? Hamburger. I would like to buy a hamburger. Maybe we should stop. We don't quit. We do not quit. Again, again. I would like to buy a hamburger. I would like to buy a hamburger. I would like to buy a hamburger. I would like to buy the burger. I would like to buy a hamburger. I would like to buy a hamburger. We went into a local Tim Hortons to see what vegan options they had on the menu, and I was bracing myself for whatever interaction she would have with her next victim would be. If you try to get anything vegan here, like it's pretty difficult. There's a dead chicken there, chicken eggs, um, cheese. There's bacon, which is a dead pig. You can, if you don't coffee, it's vegan, right? Yeah. It's water and coffee beans, and it is, uh, if you use soy milk or oat milk, that's great. She then noticed that there was a ramen restaurant right next to the vegan restaurant, and it had the little pig on the logo. So you put your glasses on, you get new glasses, and then you can decide where do you want to go? Like the place that is full of, you know, life. The pig there, but the, the pig is dead. It's death and death and death and murder. Three, two, one, sing. Eating animals is wrong, McDonald's. Hurting animals is wrong, McDonald's. Share this song and change your entire menu to be vegan from now on. <laughs> I want to say how. Hi. How are you? Good, we're good. So actually, I'm going to let Ben choose what we're going to eat. Oh, okay. Ben of the week who is ordering all the food for us. So excited. Listen, I've spent a lot of time in Los Angeles around the most hardcore influencers who film every second and every minute of their lives. And being around this woman, they have nothing on her. Eating animals is wrong, Gordon Ramsay. Hurting animals is wrong, Gordon Ramsay. Share this song. And if you call me a donut, it's fine. Vegan donut. Your vegan from now on. SS Sniper Wolf, if you're watching this, if you don't wake up tomorrow, it won't bother me at all. And in fact, honestly, I would be kind of happy. Welcome to class, everybody, and especially to you, Nick Akato Avocado. Your channel has become boring, extremely cruel, and sick in the head. It's important to eat your cruciferous vegetables every day. Pack them in, put them in your smoothies. You know, sprout little bean. This! Oh. Cruciferous vegetables, which are high in oxalates and anti-nutrients, and you're telling people to put them in smoothies. Who are you, lady? Don't even do a morsel of research on the people that you're supposedly making videos about. I was probably vegan longer than you've been vegan. Well, actually, no, you've probably been doing it a long time. Look at you with your black teeth rotten out of your face. <sighs> Classes in session, vegans. Let's say our ABCs together. C is for chicken. C is for collagen, which your body requires for proper skin, hair, and brain health. C is for chicken, lady. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Hello, students. Well, I'm going to be honest with you. It was really hard for me to bring myself to the camera today to, to talk to you because, um, well, I am still suffering from Vistopia. And Vistopia is the anguish of being vegan in a non-vegan world. It's this uh, continued sadness that animal rights activists have, where we know about the horrible suffering that's going on and 
some days we just feel really powerless like it seems like it will never end and some days it's harder to stay positive than than on other days <laughs>